student welcome to bio spirit today i am discussing first puc biology important topics for annual exam 2024 and 24 to 25 so in this video we will discuss first botany part and i will make one more video on the zoology part okay let us discuss first chapter is a living world from living world they will arise only questions on main three topics first topic is a that is binomial nomenclature so it means they will arise the questions on universal rules of nomenclature or they will arise on direct on that is binomial nomenclature and second they will arise the questions on taxonomic hierarchy like the definition of taxonomic hierarchy and explain the each taxons here you have to explain kingdom to genus and next third topic is a, they will arise question on that is by scientific name or biological name genus name family order class phylum or division of the men or housefly or mango or wheat from mango housefly and wheat anyone they will arise a question so if for example they will arise a question on mango so you have to write mango scientific name it means biological name genus name family and order class phylum like that you have to write in exam and second chapter is a biological classification so here they will arise a question on mycoplasma write a short note on mycoplasma and next they will arise a questions on types of protozoans and next is there that is differentiate between the phycomycetes and ascomycetes and next diagram they will ask any one diagram they will ask uh, out of two they will give one diagram compulsory that is tmv and or bacteriophage so next is there differentiate between mycobiont and phycobiont next chapter is there plant kingdom from plant kingdom they will arise a question on only three topics first one is there, it is most important topic they will arise regularly so that is right economic importance of the bryophyte or algae they will ask either the economic importance of algae or bryophyte and next they will arise a question on short note on gymnosperm and next is there, the most important that is they will arise the questions on liverworts and mosses they may arise the question differentiate between the liverwort or mosses or they will arise the question on separate next chapter is there, morphology of flowering plant from morphology of flowering plant they will arise the questions on few topic first is there, reasons of root so you have to write the reasons of root with label diagram and next is there, astivation so in flower you will get astivation you have to write the types of astivation and next monocotyledon seed diagram so it is also most important is it and next they will arise a question on the description of a solanaceae family either they will ask the question based on that is floral diagram and floral formula of solanum nizerum and next they will arise a question on the definition of inflorescence here they will it in case they are arise on the two marks means you have to write the definition of inflorescence and you have to write one or two example for the inflorescence next is their anatomy of flowering plant in from anatomy of flowering plant they will arise the question on epidermal tissue system in epidermal tissue system they will arise the question on trichome function what is the function of trichome and they may arise the definition plus the tri trichome fun function and next they will arise the questions on the types of stomata so here two types of stomata is there one normal bean shape or kidney shape another one dumbbell shape question is there there is one fixed question from the that is tiers of monocot or dicot root stem leaf so from dicot root stem leaf or monocot root stem leaf they will arise any one question either may they will arise description level or they will, uh, they can arise a diagram next chapter is their structural organization in animals so from this chapter they will arise the questions on based on three main topics first is they draw a neat label diagram of frog digestive system and male reproductive system and female reproductive system from three diagram they will arise any one question next is a in case they are, if they not arise the question on diagrams they will arise the question on explanation of the circulatory system and excretory system of the frog next chapter is a cell from cell chapter they will arise the question on the cell theory and fluid mosaic model of plasma membrane write a short note on plastids it means here you have to write all three types of plastid and sometimes they arise the question specific on chloroplast and next the types of chromosome based on the position of centromere 
so you have here you have to write the four type of send chromosomes and with the diagram next one is a draw a neat label diagram of the plant cell or animal cell chapter is a cell cycle and cell division from cell cycle and cell division they will arise a question on main three topics first is a draw a label diagram of cell cycle and explain it in detail so here you have to write the cell cycle diagram and plus you have to explain z1 phase z2 phase s phase and my uh, prophase metaphase anaphase and telophase and next is a second topic that is what is the significance of meiosis or mitosis maybe they will arise a question on meiosis or mitosis it is also most important is a many times they arise a question so either my meiosis significance or mitosis significance next topic is there explain the process of meiosis one so here you have to explain the whole the meiosis one types for example prophase one metaphase one anaphase one telophase one sometimes they will arise a question only on the prophase if they arise a question only on the prophase means you have to write subtype of the prophase one like zygotene pagetine diplotin dikinesis like that the next chapter is there photosynthesis in higher plant so here they will arise a question differentiate between the c3 and c4 cycle so how to write c3 and c4 cycle difference and next they will arise a question on the same the differentiate between the cyclic and non-cyclic photophosphorylation and next th third one is there. here i merged two topics in one question only that is c3 and c4 cycle difference and cyclic and non-cyclic photophosphorylation so they will arise the question on any one topic so that's why i combined in only one and next second topic is there. write the schematic representation of z scheme of light reaction z scheme of light reaction means here you have to focus on non-cyclic photophosphorylation and next third one is here explain the kelvin cycle with the diagrammatic representation it is also most important is here and next write a short note on factor affecting on photosynthesis here you have to write that is light temperature and humidity water molecules etc and next chapter is there respiration in plant so from respiration in plant they will arise any one question from the three topics that is schematic representation of glycolysis here i did mistake and next graph cycle etc etc means electron transport chain just you how to write that cycle glycolysis cycle graph cycle and etc chapter is there plant growth and development so from this chapter they will arise a question on main two topics so that is definition of differentiation dedifferentiation and redifferentiation and next topic they will arise a questions plant growth regulation that is auxin superlin cytokinin and abscisic acid today i completed full by botany part and i will make one more video on the zoology part thank you for watching